Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my cooking channel. Well, I want to show you something today. Look at this weather. Winter is not going. Winter want to stay a little a bit more. Usually it's a some uh, spring time, but look at the snow outside. My goodness. Too bloody cold. Trust me. But anyway, let's get start with our video. Today I'm going to make lemon meringue tart and uh, I will share with you the recipe. So stay tuned. Thank you very much. Look at this amazing view, man. I like snow, but it's too cold, man. Here are the ingredients I'm going to use for my lemon meringue tart. I'm using whole eggs, egg yolk, castor sugar, fresh lemon juice, gelatin powder, butter, lemon zest. This is for the lemon curd. This egg white and sugar I'm using for meringue. Tart shell I already baked for the recipe. Please check about the link I already post for the recipe and the method basically it has three stages first I'm going to make lemon curd second will be meringue and third is tart shell which is petasable dough and for the petasable dough as I told you check out my link above for uh, apple tart and you can find there the recipe with the method Sorry guys, I forgot to mention the whipped cream. I'm going to use this for the lemon curd. So let's begin. Lemon curd, for that, I'll use whole egg, egg yolk, sugar, Some lemon just for making lemon curd, use ban mary or hot water, keep on whisking so it will not stuck in bottom. Keep on whisking all the time until the texture will become thick. You cannot stop actually because the liquid will stuck in the bottom and it will be uh, giving some lumps which will not give a good texture for the lemon curd. So basically this process will take around 5 to 10 minutes until it become thick. As you can see now, it's getting thicker. It's almost ready now. A few more minutes, but keep on whisking. Don't stop. It's done now. You cut this thick custard. Take it out. It's still hot. Transfer into a deep bowl. Use the hand blender or a whisk again. Okay. 
keep on adding butter butter is melted already I soak some gelatin add it and the mixture is still hot so we don't need to heat it up the gelatin it will dissolve keep on blending until the gelatin mix well it's done now look the consistency let it cool down and then keep it in the chiller super nice now i will whip the cream i'm using full fat 36 percent cream thick cream use the hand blender you know uh, you can add some sugar in your whipped cream when you are whipping just for the sweetness if you like it otherwise you can just uh, whip the plain see nice thick whipped cream keep it in the chiller after that straight now I'm going to make meringue for that I will take egg white Whisk it without sugar for one or two minutes. The time you will see the texture will be coming into a form. Add sugar slowly, slowly. Now you can see it's becoming a foamy, light because the air is getting inside. some more time now you can see it's getting thick and uh, completely white like snow more, give, it, give it more time let the sugar dissolve completely since the meringue is taking time I'll start preparing the lemon curd cream Get this custard. And cut. Consistency. Do first. Mix it Mix nicely. Okay, it's done. Now we fill the tarts with this cream. See, I'm using the packing bag. Just fill it nicely. Now it's done. State goes to the chiller about two to five minutes, just to set the cream. It's done now. It will be uh, look like this. Hard peak. Now I will prepare the tart. I'm going to fill this meringue into this piping bag. I'm using the star nozzle. So basically, what I will do, I will pipe this meringue on the top of this lemon tart. This is a very nice and a very simple and tasty recipe. Whatever design you like, you want to make, you can make. It's plenty of designs, plenty of ways to uh, put meringue on the top of the tart. I'm just using very simple and uh, technique. Use the blow torch. Done. 
so this is done simple recipe now I will do some plating and it's optional of, of course let's see here are two serving suggestions as I always show in my videos like a signature <laughs> so you can skip it you can make your own way if you want whatever way you want to design your meringue so I hope you will like this recipe guys this is super cool super tasty and uh, very easy recipe to bring it into your party or uh, tea time coffee time so enjoy it super nice and tasty dessert trust me try this recipe at home you will love it your friends gonna love it your family gonna love it and uh, it's a very easy and simple recipe give me a comments and like and subscribe my channel if you like the recipe and keep sharing my videos support me and uh, thank you very much see you soon there is a lot more to come so stay tuned